The Brazos County Sheriff's Office says they're facing recruiting challenges and staffing shortages. Now, the Sheriff's Office, though, says it is secure $20,000 that they hope will eventually lead to a solution to that. Julia Lewis explains. In our office, we at one point we had as many as 35 vacancies in the jail, and so it made it really difficult to do everything that we're required to do. The Brazos County Sheriff's Office has struggled to recruit and retain their employees. And Sheriff Wayne Dickey says their current employees have to make up for those vacancies, many working mandatory overtime. We've got people working additional shifts, and it makes it difficult to allow people to use vacation holidays and things like that. But the Chief Deputy of Corrections came across an article with a possible solution. I actually saw a news article from Midland County that they'd used this company and uh, that they were fully staffed. County commissioners approved $20,000 for the Sheriff's Office to invest in the company Advanced Recruitment Solutions and a contract was approved last week. The people that we have, uh, that, that they've recommended the contract with uh, and the results that I've heard from other counties have been good. Stewart said this company has worked with other counties who have seen good results. We consider it a great investment in the future and we're hoping to hire some people who are going to make a career here and so it's just, uh, like I said, money well spent, good investment. Going from an approach where we were looking for people who were looking for work is now this company is going to help us to look for qualified people that may already be employed. The recruitment process will take two months and the sheriff's office is hoping to be fully staffed by the end of December. In Bryan, Julia Lewis, News 3. By the end of this week, the sheriff's office and advanced recruitment solutions hope to have a plan on what the next two-month recruitment process will look like.